Good morning, movers. Welcome back to Move Daily Fitness. I'm Tracy Steen. All right, your workout today is going to be a total body workout. We're gonna do a Luca format, so lower body, upper body, cardio, and abs. We'll cycle through those. It's going to be a no repeat, so we'll just do each exercise only once. And your format will be 45 seconds of work, only 10 seconds in between. Because we're shortening the time frame, we're gonna really kick it up with a shorter rest period as well. Grab a variety of dumbbells for the workout. That's all you'll need. And we'll start you with a warm up and end with a cool down. Hey, don't forget we do have a Move Daily membership where we offer weekly workout schedules in advanced or beginner, lots of nutrition coaching, challenges, support, and camaraderie. You can join that group by clicking the card at the top of the screen or check out the description below. All right, are you ready to move daily? Let's do it. All right, I'm gonna hit uh, high intensity intervals on the watch. Let's warm things up right here. Start with a hip opener. <laughs> Start with a hip opener. Sound like I'm a, a anchor on a television. Here's your weather forecast. <laughs> Actually, that was, I wanted to do that when I was uh, a child. That's what I wanted to be, was a anchor on a TV. I missed my calling. <laughs> You're here. Touch the toes. One more here. And turn your toes out, stay wide, and plie, open in the chest. Bring it a little closer. We'll do a squat with a front kick, alternating sides. One more here, and arm circles. Switch directions. Good, let's tap it across. Stretch those lats. Up and over. Heel digs, sweep and switch. One more here, and torso turn. All right, very nice. There's the first Luca. We're starting with lower body. Starting with a front squat. I've got my 15s here. Rack it. Drop it low. And low and drive. Flex your quads at the top here. Holding 15s, we're gonna hinge at the waist for that road hammer curl. Super flat back, row it here. Full stand and hammer here.
Set those down. I'm going into your traveling high knee. You could stay in one spot or low impact right here. Otherwise, four, three, two, one. Back for four, three, two, one. shoulder tap. Okay, mod this from the knees and tap, otherwise from the toes. And we tap and tap. Thumbs down and try not to rock those hips. I'm gonna grab my 30 pound dumbbell for that plie squat. Nice and wide in your stance. All right, pulse at the bottom. Toes are out. And we low, low, and up. Shoulder press. All right, supinated, palms face the ceiling. You're gonna bring it up to the ceiling and down, alternating sides. All right, so up, up, and down. Elbow is soft. Okay, or a slight bend in the elbow there. We're coming up to the ceiling and down. Core faces the front though, nice and stable in the torso. And your double frog squat. All right. So you're here, here, and up. Let's go. Double, up, double. Down for your princess sit up, I'll call half and we'll switch. On your tiptoe here, leg is straight, all the way up, here we go. And we reach, same side and reach. Point that toe.
Switch legs. Also down here with that 30 for my glute thrust coming up. All right, setting the 30 on my pelvis. <sighs> Glute thrusts, little pulse at the top. So you're up, pulse, and drop. Up, pulse, and drop. Nice, good hold on your dumbbell. more seconds then we'll flip over for your up down plank I'll do a dumbbell pass with this 30 as well all right plank position elbow elbow hand hand reach and pass the dumbbell mod from the knees so elbow elbow hand hand reach and pass All right, donkey kicks down here. You want to modify, hover position, alternating kick there. Otherwise, kick your butt. Side crunch, that was hard. We'll stay on each side for 45 seconds here. Lay it out and crunch it here. Nice one. Arm is overhead. Then you bring that elbow to the outside of your leg. Stay with me on this side. And switching. Whew. That fired things up. All right, here we go, and we crunch. Almost there, 10 seconds. Then we'll give you a, a little bit of a water rest and time to come back up to standing. Three, two, crunch. All right, up you get. 
grab a drink. All right, three pulse squat jump. You can three pulse squat to tiptoes for low impact. Otherwise, drop it for three, two, one, and jump. to abs, plank hip drop on your elbows, side to side hip drop, bum is down, and we drop here and here. If you need to mod this, drop to the knees, but eliminate the hip drop side to side. Standing for those alternating front lunges coming up. All right, I think I'll grab 12s here. Alternating sides, nice and tall, and drop. fives for that Arnold kick out. Go light on this one. You're here. Bring it in. Kick it out. There it is. These are soft. And stick your chest out in that extension. All right, hop jumping lunges. You can reverse lunge, alternating for low impact. Here we go. on your back. Alternating toe tap, reach to the outside of your foot. Here we go, and reach, reach. Now if you need to support your head, you're just doing that turn, reaching elbow up instead.
into your tiptoe squat. Holding 15s, I'll go half. We'll switch the toe and drop right here and drive. And right up on that tiptoe. It's putting a lot of your tension and weight on that flat foot side. One more here. Switch the toe. All right, skull crushers. I'll stick with this 15. Rest if you need in between. Elbows close. Press. Side frog shuffle. Do a low impact wide squat if you don't want to jump. Drop it low and frog here, here, and back. hard on your back hitting that bicycle and reach and reach And make your way up to standing. You've got about 20 seconds. Grab a sip of water. And make sure you're not dizzy here. Grabbing my 15s for that suitcase squat deadlift combo. Peter shoulder width. Start with the suitcase squat. And we drop it here and hinge and stand. Good. Setting down one of the 15s and going right into my clean and snatch. A little bit of hip here as well, but let's focus on that shoulder. Drop it low and snatch. Press it to the ceiling, I will call half. Last 
Last here. Switch hands. Broad jump with your three jumps back. You can giant step and tap back for a low impact. Here we go. I'll hold that 10 for my Russian twist. You can eliminate the weight if you need. Reach the elbow back. Stay close to the body and reach. Into your sumo squat. I'll call half, I'm gonna hold my 30 here. We'll switch hands, wide stance. Drop it low and drive. Feet face the forward, uh, the front. Just a slight angle out. Drop it low and drive through that flat foot. One more here. Switch your hand. Very nice, going to those 15s. Pinwheel curls. Cross in front, palms face the ceiling, shoulders back, and we curl and switch. Ten more seconds into the split split squat. <sighs> tap tap squat for low impact. Here we go.
Last exercise, going into that frog uh, crunch. Feet together, kick it out and in. All right, so all the way out and then little hip hop here and out. Modify with a single leg extension. Doing well, you're halfway. Almost done, folks. Stay in the pocket. I'm not sure I understand. How do you not understand that? You have to just stay in the pocket, which means you can't quit. <laughs> let's go, let's go. In three, two, one and done. You move daily in your Luca. 30 minute blast. That was sweaty. Join down here for a stretch if you can. All right, quick little stretch down here. Let's go into a glute stretch first. Good little combo, a little bit of everything there. Uh, it was sweaty anyway. That 10 second in between is not nothing. It's just like there's no heart rate recovery, so it stays, I mean, very little. So it stays elevated, which is nice when you're looking for bang for your buck. I know a lot of people throughout the summer are enjoying the 30 minute sessions because you have other things to do, right? Maybe you don't have as much time. Um, some of you have more time this summer. You know, you're not, you're, you don't have to rush the kids to school. So you've got a little bit more time and you're enjoying the longer workout. So that's why there's a little bit of everything. Our summer strong calendar is the advanced one is a combination. So anywhere between 30 and 60 minutes. The beginner calendar is 30 minutes only. Uh, and then I have also the 30 minute advanced calendar. So I've got a calendar for everything really. <laughs> uh, the advanced calendar is a combination of cardio and strength, but mostly strength based. Uh, workouts like this where you're, you know, you've got one cardio element thrown in there, but you're really giving it uh, a lot of bang for your buck and uh, trying to focus on muscle growth as well. Now, a workout like this that's no repeat, I wouldn't say necessarily is a good for, like, I'm gonna grow my muscles bigger because you don't have enough volume on each exercise, right? Do you understand? Like, we only did one tricep exercise for one set. So, technically, in order to grow triceps, throughout a given week, you have to have a lot more volume than just the one set. You would need anywhere between 10 and 20 sets, okay, in order to have that muscle adapt to the load and then have that little microscopic tear in the fibers and then the rebuild and repair of the muscle. That's how it grows bigger. And then of course, your adequate amount of protein will help it to grow as well. So. These are great though, like if you're like, well, I just don't have time right now, it's not the season of life I'm in, I need to get in, get out. This is awesome then, like do this. It's better than not doing anything. So never think that it's not beneficial because I mean, I'm sweaty, my heart rate got up there, I was using my muscles, I was working my ligaments and joints, I was bearing weight, so I'm thrilled. And sometimes this is all I have time for or energy for as well as the 30 minutes. So this is why I do them. <laughs> I did a long workout yesterday. I was very gassed from it, very fatigued. I did a big glute workout for the members and I could not manage much else today. So this is this is was on the this was on the docket and I'm happy for it. All right, thanks for joining Go Move Daily in your wellness and nutrition. If you're looking for any of those programs, check the links in the description below. Okay, they're all down there. See ya in the next workout.